Good morning everyone. It is 6.45 in the morning. I just finished working and now I'm going to work out. So uh, I started working at 4.40 this morning. So I woke up about 4.20 and yeah, now I'm ready to just get some exercise in, get some energy for the day. Hopefully I'll get some stuff in before Josie wakes up. She doesn't normally wake up until after eight. So I think I have a good hour as long as I'm not too loud. Today is Steven's day off. So I'm not really sure what we're going to do. He already left actually to go do a hike. I could have gone with my guests, but he his hike's further away. So he left at like five o'clock so that he could be back here around 10 or 11 so that we could do something else for the rest of the day. So I think once Josie wakes up, I might take her on a walk, kind of depending on what time she wakes up and what time I get her fed and everything. And then hopefully we'll go do something fun today. We might go to Lagoon, we might go to the zoo again. We'll kind of figure out what we're going to do once that time comes. But for now, let me go get started working out because it's time to do that. <laughs> It's 9.30 now. I worked out for about 30 to 45 minutes. I'm hoping to get some like walking in today. So I just did ab and leg stuff and then a little bit of arms. Miss Josie just woke up. She's sitting there watching cartoons on my phone so that I could do her hair. But I'm going to make us breakfast really quick and then hopefully Steven will be home in the next hour or two so that we can go and do something with our day. Hi pretty girl. Is your hair so cute? It's the baby. Oh, yucky, you have dried milk on your lips. Ooh. <sighs> Yawning. It's been several hours since my last clip. Since then, Steven's gotten home. I don't even remember what my last clip was. I think I was giving Josie breakfast. So she and I ate breakfast, Steven got home. Now we are headed to a lake. Reservoir? Something like that. We're gonna go kind of hang out there for a few hours, grab some lunch on the way. Sorry, we're driving right now, so this is probably like <laughs> shaky. I think Piney Reservoir. I forget what it's called. Pine something. So we're in a Pine something reservoir or lake or whatever. But we're also going to stop and get chairs because weirdly enough, Steve and I didn't get any camping stuff when we got married. That's just something we totally forgot to ask for. So we don't have camp chairs. So we're going to stop and grab some camp chairs. Hopefully, we'll see if we can find any. And then grab lunch and then go up to the lake. We'll hang out there for a few hours and then I think we're going to go to Lagoon later today for Josie because she likes going there. And Mondays are usually not too busy. So if we get someone to go with us, then he and I can usually ride rides too. So we'll see. Um, I guess we'll kind of play it as it goes. Josie's just in the back there watching her show being nice and quiet, so. All right, well, yes, we're on our way. <laughs> we just finished up at Sam's and the DI. We both got lawn chairs, camping chairs, whatever, I guess. Anyway, so that's great. Uh, and now we're off to lunch, which I think we're both, all three of us actually, are very excited for. One hour later. We just finished lunch at Cafe Rio, so we're on our way up to the reservoir now. That's how she feels about That's how she feels about things. Diva needed her binky. How long will it take us to get there? Half hour. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. We probably won't stay very long because I just don't see Josie wanting to stay very long. So I guess we'll see you guys at the lake. It's kind of boring to just sit here and watch us drive, so. not to go to the reservoir. We got, we got all the way up there and to the gate and realized it was eight dollars to get in and we're just not going to be there very long. Like we'd probably be there like 45 minutes top and my prediction would be even less than that. It's time for her to have a nap and there's not much we can do. Like we don't have swimsuits. It's kind of too cold in that water to swim anyway. At least I'm pretty sure. So anyway, we decided not to. We're not taking the scenic route home. And then hopefully she falls asleep and naps part of it. Otherwise, we'll just put her down once we get home. Uh, we might go to Lagoon later still. We're still 
not sure. We're just kind of playing it as it goes. Not really having concrete plans, which is fine. Um, it is kind of a bummer that we drove all the way up there, <laughs> but it's okay. It's it's nice to get out of the house and see things. So. We are officially home and we're all pretty tired. So we're gonna go put Josie down for a nap. Maybe take a nap ourselves. I'm trying not to take naps because I get up for work at 4.20. So I need to go to bed early. 4.20. <laughs> he laughs every time I say that. And it's been like a year. Anyway, so I try not to take naps because if I take a nap then I usually am not tired in time to go to bed again. But I'm feeling pretty exhausted today so I think I might go take a power nap or at least just lay down and chill. So let's go get the gremlin into bed. We just redid the room. I'm still like so in love with it. I'll do a little room tour later but for now let's pull over her cardboard that I make her room dark with because these blinds I swear do nothing. Noise machine. <laughs> Okay, it's Baba. Okay, it's time to go to sleep, okay? Yes, I love you. Mm. All right, good night, Josie. We did it. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it's not that hard to put her down for naps, so. Anyway, we're gonna go nap too. And then yeah. we'll probably go to Lagoon, whether or not people come with us, because she rides the rides, and that's kind of the main reason we go. I mean, I love riding rides, don't get me wrong, and Steven does too, but it's just so cute to see her riding the rides that we grew up riding. I'll hurry and give you guys a tour of Josie's room. So when you walk in, you have this little watercolor from her Aunt Courtney. Uh, here's her bed. Over there is her toy chest. So this is just filled with toys. We've got her little backpack on top. Here's our book cart, which has a few other random toys, and it's right next to the rocking chair. This stuff in the window is what I use to keep it dark, so that when she's sleeping, it's actually dark. I have another piece that I like move over when it's nap time or bedtime. Anyway, there's another fox kind of canvas and there's these super cute triangles my brother made for me to put in here. And they've got little succulents, fake succulents, of course. This isn't supposed to be here. We just haven't gotten rid of it yet. And then we just got this dresser in here. So really like that. We got these flowers, which are her room colors. This cactus sign, because her room's kind of like cactus slash fox themed. Where you less, smile more. This little wire basket holds all of her bows and hats. We've got her noise machine hidden here. This was the first stuffed animal we ever got her, this little fox. This sign, if you follow me on Instagram, you already know about it, but it's actually a card that Steven and I got for our wedding. So even though it's super cheesy and like basic white girl, I cut it out and saved it because I thought it was cute and it reminds me of my wedding and it's all sparkly. So who doesn't like a sparkly? thing. Got her salt rock lamp that we turn on during the night as her nightlight and then these two fake cactus plants. So that's her little setup on her desk. This chalkboard we used at my wedding and then I just repurposed it for her room. So Josephine Sage with the little cactus. And then family pictures are there or pictures of Josie I guess. So we used to have a changing table here and we kept stuff there and then all of her clothes which are in here used to be in this which is underneath the window then this was back in the corner and anyway but now it's more of a big girl room back here we've got laundry hamper there's the camera to keep an eye on her and we don't have any issues with it being right here she doesn't play with it so for now that's where it's staying it's been there for a while <laughs> this is actually the picture that inspired us for this room it was one that steven had that i always loved and we didn't know where to hang it and i was like well let's put it in Josie's room and we'll make her room fox themed, so. And then this little mobile here, mobile, however you say it, I made for Josie. And then last is just kind of this macrame wall hanging. But anyway, sometimes I'll take this down and like hide it so that all the light's coming through, but she just woke up from her nap, so it's still up there. How I organize her dresser real quick, I have diapers, wipes, creams, lotions, all that type of stuff in this drawer. And then over here I have socks and tights, shoes, binkies, hair stuff, and then bloomers that go with her dresses. 
here I keep all of her clothes so I keep all of her shirts over here and then her shorts and pants are over this way I like to fold them like this that way I can keep an eye on them keep an eye on them like what are they gonna do run away when I'm not looking and then she just knows she's not supposed to get into her drawers so over here we've got her swimsuits and then her PJs most of her PJs need to get folded up and put away they just got washed and then here we've got um, a blanket and we keep kind of miscellaneous stuff so this is her shopping cart cover and her tutu we usually keep sheets in here too but I just finished washing her sheets so those need to be put away and then over here is blankets anyway that's just a quick tour of Yo-Yo's room. All right, as you can see, it is quite a bit later. It is 9.45. I totally forgot our camera at home when we went to Lagoon. I did get a few little clips of Josie, so I'll insert them right here. that we came home got Josie some dinner put her to bed ate dinner ourselves and now I am going to just sit in bed and read a book and then go to sleep I think tomorrow I will film also and make this like a two-day vlog just because I probably only have like two minutes of footage so we'll try this again tomorrow 